Hello beauties, welcome back to my channel. It's Cece Clark here and my little baby girl Birdie Blue, or you can call her BB as we all call her. She's been good as gold, she's just come up for a feed and that's just in time because I've completed my makeup look and it only took 15 minutes. So every day I get asked, girl, how have you got time to put makeup on as a new mum? And honestly, this is how. It's my go-to glam in under 15 minutes. And these are all of my favorite products that I've been pretty much using for the past three months. I'll link them all in, all in the description box for you. But often I just feed her and do my makeup at the same time because it doesn't take too long at all. And I can sit here and do glam for hours, but now I have to use my time efficiently. So these are all the steps that I do pretty much every time I need to do a zoom or, just want to feel fresh and glam. So I put myself to the test and timed it for you. If you want to see how it plays out, keep watching. Um, but before we get into it, I just want to say that be sure to sign up to hotombrecosmetics.com if you want to be the first to know about something really exciting that's coming. And also my new single, Boys Do Cry, is out now. It's a really important message and I appreciate every single stream, every single download, any share on social media, keep using it on TikTok and Reels. It just means the world to me. Um, of course, with everything going on at the moment, I just really want that message to spread far and wide. And you know, music means the world to me as well. And trying to make it in the music industry is hard, um, but I really appreciate your support and we're in this together. And I'm never gonna give up my dreams and you shouldn't either. So thank you in advance for that. Boys Do Cry by CC Clark. I'll link the Spotify below. Oh, you're so scrummy. She's got lipstick. Also, please do hit that subscribe button. You're in for a hell of a ride if you're only just joining today because you know, there's music, there's makeup, there's clearly parenting content coming now and we've just bought our new home, which we're going to renovate. So it's, yeah, it's all popping off in, in our world at the moment. But if you wanna know how I created this look in under 15 minutes, then let's go. Okay guys, let's do this. So of course, I'm going to be timing it. And although I have tried and tested this before, I've not talked to camera and shown you the products and done it at the same time. So I'm gonna do a voiceover and let you know the products that will be linked in the description anyway. But I'm gonna keep the footage completely uncut so you can see, we can see that it really does take 15 minutes. I mean, I hope it doesn't suddenly take an hour now. <laughs> okay, let's do this and let's go. Okay, so here I'm using the Drunk Elephant Electrolyte Water Facial. It is actually supposed to be a mask, but I just love using it as a moisturizer underneath my foundation. I love this and foundation. I'm using one of my favorite foundations, which is the Beauty Blender Bounce Foundation, shade 365. And honestly, the, the flawless finish that this, this gives off is so beautiful, darling. <laughs> Onto concealer and less is definitely more these days because I have replaced where I now put my concealer which is just in the areas you can see me applying it to here and I'm using the Too Faced Born This Way concealer which is my trusty little secret weapon. Anyone recognise the song by the way? This would be Cece Clark Boys Do Cry. <laughs> I hope you're enjoying it. Any excuse to give it an extra play? So you may have noticed that I skipped the cream contour step. This is just obviously to fit within my time frame and um, I do feel like normal bronzer brings my contour to life anyway. So I'm using the Laura Mercier translucent powder to bake and then I'll move on to bronzer. But first of all, I'm just using my semi-clean brush. It's my bronzer brush with no product on just to buff in that translucent powder before adding my bronzer which is my favourite benefit hula caramel. We fight, then we're making a 
can't fix us just to break it up this time i want to feel it all but i know See, I'm really spending a lot of time buffing in that contour and bronzer. I know previously I've said that bronzing and contouring are two different things, which I stand by, but I do feel like this shade is an overall kind of good balance between the two when I haven't got time to do the two different steps. But now we need a bit of highlight, mate. <laughs> I'm actually going to move on to the Becca Champagne Pop highlight, which you can see in my hand there to just give me a bit of a glow because that's what I'm missing sorry too much married at first sight Australia it just keeps coming through mate has anybody else been watching that because it is entertaining let me tell you Now onto the brows. So I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Anastasia, however you say it, and the Brow Wiz in medium brown. I honestly don't really know why people do their brows off camera because I feel like that's the number one thing that a lot of people ask about. But um, this is my pretty much everyday little tool at the moment. I switch between this and the Benefit Precisely my brow. Both just very fine pencil. Um, eyebrow pencils don't tell me that you don't care don't tell me that you don't feel pain you're hurting when i'm not there and we're both to blame but i know boys 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 do cry and boy boy so do i as we get older talk to be strongest but what they say we feel what we want boys, boys, only a few more steps left and this has been a go-to palette actually. I love the Anastasia Beverly Hills Soft Glam Palette. I feel like there's pretty much everything in this palette that you need. And I just use a few of the warm shades and the dusty rose shade. Oh, it's just really a beautiful neutral palette. And I always love it when there's a dark black in an eyeshadow palette because I often use it as an eyeliner, which you will see me attempt here because, I mean, when we've got 15 minutes, we've not got long enough to do the liquid eyeliner. <laughs> I will um, end up looking like Amy Winehouse if I attempt to do it quickly. So, which isn't necessarily a bad thing if that's the look you're going for, by the way. But, you know, I just want a little natural glam. So I use the black eyeshadow as a liner, which I do a lot of the time, actually. I smoke out my liquid liner with a, um, a black eyeshadow quite a lot to make it look a little bit smokier and sexier. But you'll see how I kind of create that wing without specific eyeliner using this palette I want to be daring baby dance the night away I let my head down if I want don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time doesn't sound like fun you can do better let me show you what a good time looks like you can do better so much better Now on to a, a wee bit of mascara. Love this one, it's the Maybelline Falsies Lash Lift. I actually did an advert for this. It's on TV and everything. Well actually I don't think I was on TV, I just lied. <laughs> I was on one of those adverts that you see all over Facebook and YouTube and, and whatnot. Love working with Maybelline. And now on to Hot Ombre Cosmetics, my brand. Um, this is one of my favourite nude lipsticks, which is the Immortal Matte Lip Ombre Kits double-ended so it makes your lips look extra plump two shades that complement each other 
and that was the shade beach and now I'm going to apply please into the center of my lips just to add dimension and plumpness by the way if you're watching this around Valentine's Day 2021 um, use code heat to get 20% off everything at Hot Ombre Cosmetics I didn't want to write it down because um, there's only a few days left but if you're watching this as the video goes live then you grab that discount honey now I'm just using the lip liner by Morphe shade forecast it's just a really nice kind of cold toned nude and it goes really well with my beach please and then the lip gloss is lip injection extreme which adds even more plumpness because it stimulates your lips to make them yeah swell and go juicy and that's by Too Faced and that's the last step can't believe it okay I think that's everything Maybe just a little bit of nose contour. Maybe some inner corner highlight. Yeah, I think that's everything. Let's stop. Guys, guys, 14 minutes, 59 seconds, get in. <laughs> wow, I'm impressed with myself. That is my 15 minute full glam. No step spared other than, um, other than maybe stick contouring, cream contouring rather. Um, that's the only step that I skip when I'm doing my 15 minute glam. Let me zoom you in so you can get a closer look at this makeup. I mean, I love it guys, do you? Would you do this? Let me know if you're gonna try it out. Um, everything linked in the description, by the way, is all pretty much from one place, which um, helps you guys out. It's not um, in collaboration with Cult Beauty, but I just found that Cult Beauty um, stocked pretty much everything that I have been using daily at the moment and for this tutorial. Obsessed with this nude lip combo. Um, it's actually Hot Ombre Beach Please, which I probably mentioned, but it's my favourite nude at the moment. So gorgeous and thank you so much for your support on Hot Ombre, my brand. We've got some exciting things coming. The only thing I would say this makeup look is missing, which I would have time for, I'd say, um, is a blush. And I almost reached for something that is top secret that I've been using as a blush every day for the past, I don't know how long, but um, I can't wait to share more with you. So make sure you sign up to Hot Ombre. There's some newness coming. And um, for everyone that signed up, you will get first dibs, uh, VIP access 24 hours early ahead of the launch so that you don't miss out obviously to reward our hot ombre hotties. But yeah, you're gonna love what's coming and I'm so proud of it. And um, we're going in a new direction. Well, we're just broadening out the hot ombre product family. So I've said too much anyway. <laughs> I mean, I just can't believe that this takes 15 minutes just so pleased and that is why when people are like how do you wear makeup as a new mum it takes 15 minutes I do it whilst I'm breastfeeding like prop her up on a pillow make sure she's all secure get on with it and on that note I have a little visitor birdie say hello to everyone <laughs> she's making some funny little noises bless her <laughs> she is actually due a feed now so we'll have a little cuddle a little feed you're being a good girl, aren't you, with Daddy downstairs? Oh, I just love her so much, it hurts. <laughs> thank you so much for watching, though, Buttes. As I said, I'll leave the links in the description. Um, also, thank you for following our motherhood, pregnancy, everything journey. It's been amazing to connect with so many of you. And thank you if you're an OG and you've been here from the beginning. Um, you all mean the world to me. Please subscribe. Stay here for the ride. We've got lots more in store. And um, yeah, makeup, motherhood, 
singing, house renovations, what on earth next? <laughs> Crazy life I've got, isn't it, Birdie? Oh, my little BB stop growing. Also, let me know what other makeup content you want from me on YouTube and Instagram. I'll be replying to your comments or any questions down below. And we'll see you on the next one, beauts. Love you lots. Bye. Say bye. Say bye. <laughs>